Good morning, great ones. How are you today? I am good. While I'm taking the roll call, please uh, get your exercise book, your pencil and your ruler. Remember today we said that we're going to do, we're going to have a classwork. So it is individual work. I am going to go screen by screen with you. Okay, so while you are writing, I will also be writing. So today it's, it's individual work, boys and girls. Okay, so I'm taking register so long. So while you get your exercise book, and then Monday we are going to mark it together. All right, I see Gabriel. Uh, Abongi we. Uh, Diresh. Wawe. Nika. Nathan, Reese, Sean, Terence, okay. All right, the others will join us. Tunashe. Let's see. Okay, all right. Um, are you ready with your exercise books? Are you ready? Oh, Terence, you're Franklin. All right, Terence, let's see, Franklin. All right, I've corrected it. And then Charlton. Okay. All right, I've put you Charlton, you are present. Great, shall we start? Can I see your thumbs up? Yes, 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 we can start. Okay. Ready? Okay. Right, here we go. So I want you to, to write this in your exercise book. So while you're writing, I'm also writing so that I can uh, be sure of the time that we we are spending. Okay. Can I go to the next slide?
Malaki, we are doing our last week this morning. Okay, are you done with the first slide? You can just type in yes. Okay, Gabriel. Okay, as long as you have written the question, okay, here you, you, you have to count how many you have, and then you're going to write it there. You're going to count there how many blocks you have. You're going to write your answer there. And then here on top, you are going to um, write in blocks how many, what is your answer. Uh, if you add these blocks plus these blocks, how many blocks do you get? You must draw this as well here. And then after you've put your number here and also there, you're going to tell us when you put them together, how much is it? Okay. All right, like I said, I'm also writing with you so that uh, we keep the pace, all right. Let me go to the next screen. And then when we are all done, we can go back. Okay, here we go. All right, it looks almost the same. There I've given you an example. So you don't have to, to do the example, okay? Just write this one. This is an example that I have one, two, three, four, five stars. And then I am taking away two stars. So I wrote my five there and I wrote my two there. So if I take away two stars there, how many stars will I be left with? So I take away my two stars there, and then I see that I'm left with three stars. And I put my stars there. And then I also in a, a number form, I've written my three there. So you don't have to do the example, okay? Just do the, the blocks, the block one, the one which follows, okay? Okay, uh, Malaki, um, today what we are doing, you are writing it on in your exercise book. So today we are not going to share answers. I'm also writing in my exercise book here. So also write on your exercise book. Okay, um, can we go to the next one? Okay, let's go to the next one. So same applies to this one. 
I have done the first one for you. You don't have to write it. 5 plus 5 equals 2, 10. Try as much as possible to, to, to do it yourself so that you can see where you are struggling. And then that will help us to, to help you, you know? Okay. Remember, you can use your fingers, you can use your counters. Um, yeah. For now, don't use the calculator. Can I go to the next slide? Are you writing, Kunashe? Okay, Nathan, um, don't show us your answers today. Write them on your exercise book. And then Monday, we are going to talk about our answers. So write it on your exercise book. Okay, get your exercise book, Puseleto. Okay, now let's go to the next slide. Same applies to this one. The first one, I have done it for you. 10 minus 5 equals to 5. So you're going to do 11 minus 6 equals 2. You're going to write it in your exercise book. And then the next one, 12 minus 7 equals 2. You're going to write it in your book. I'm writing together with you. Okay, shall we go to the next one? Are you comfortable that I can go to the next one? Okay, let's see Mika. Okay, or perhaps what you can do is that you can just write the question, okay, and then uh, you can work it out, okay, so that we, we go through all the questions. Yeah? I think for now, 
and it's okay not to want to do the answers together, but you can just uh, write the question and then you will, during your spare time, you will, uh, you will finish. If you think we are going a bit faster, okay? Going to the next one. So here we are counting in tens, starting from three. Okay, Bushe, uh, what we are doing today, Bushe, we are writing it in our exercise books. Today we are not sharing on the chat. Um, just get your exercise book and just write the activities. I think what we should do, grade ones, is that um, let's not look at completing the answers now let us just write or i'm sure maybe some of you are, are are taking a snapshot okay or a screenshot okay but those who do not you can just write it write the activity as it is and then if you think you are going fast don't stress as long as you have captured what you have to do, you will do it uh, as soon as we have written all the questions, okay? So I'm going to the next one, grade ones. Okay, so here we are counting in eights, starting from eight, and remember, we have our counters there that we can use, okay? So let's write out the questions. So it is important for you to also write the counting in eights. So you draw your number line there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight.
Okay, have you written the question? All righty, let's go to the next one. Remember, I will go back. Let's just capture the questions. Okay, Duresh. For the sake of time, don't force to get your answers first. Let us capture the question and then we will, we will write our answers. So I'm going to the next screen, Nediresh. Okay. So here we are writing the complete the missing number symbol or number name. So here we've given you the number name, which is one. So we want you to write the number symbol, okay? So you don't have to worry about the others, just fill in the gaps. Like this one, they want the number symbol of, of uh, this number name one. So you just write the answer there. And the next one, they've given you the number symbol. You write the number name there. Okay. They've given you the number name five. And then you're going to write the number symbol five there. They've given you the number symbol there, seven. And then they want you to write seven uh, using words. Give the number name for seven. They've given you the number name there, eight. And then you must write eight as a number symbol. Okay. All right, I'm going to the next one. And then I will, I will go back as long. I think this one is much easier because you were just writing the answers there. Okay, great ones. Okay, to go to the next slide. Okay. Right. Here, Benny has 10 marbles. And his friend, Trevor, has eight. How many marbles do they have all together? You can just write the the answer there. Benny has 10 marbles and his friend Trevor has eight. How many marbles do they have all together? Okay. All right, good. And then the next one, who has more marbles, Benny or Trevor? Who has more marbles, Benny or Trevor? So you just write um, the correct answer there. Yeah. 
Buset. Terence. Okay, and then the last one. The last one, they write the names of the banknotes before, below. Here is a banknote. Um, write it the way uh, we write money, okay? So that anybody who reads it can see that it is money that you wrote, okay? Okay. Shall we go to the next slide? And then what you can do for yourself, you can, um, for you to, to, to know which one, you, which uh, activity you are doing, you can just put bullets just to show that it is a next activity. Just put bullets for yourself, these dots, okay? Right, shall you go to the next slide? Red ones. Okay, thank you very much for the feedback. Okay, now, Here's the next one. So even this one here, you don't have to write all these words. Just write, is this shape a 2D or a 3D? You just write your answer there. If you're able to, to take a screenshot, that would also be helpful for you when you want to revise especially. If you're able to take a snapshot or you're able to go to YouTube, that would really be great, okay? The second one is this shape, a 2D or a 3D? Okay, you write your answer there. Shall I go to the next slide? Is it okay to go to the next slide? Okay, thank you for the feedback. Okay, so here, on which side of the large cube is the small cube? On which side of the large cube is a small cube? Is it to the left or is it to the right? So you just write your answer there. Is it to the left or is it to the right? We want to know where is the small cube in relation to the large cube? Is it to the left or is it to the right? And then the next one, on which side? On which side of the large ball 
Okay, on which side of the large ball is the small ball? Okay. That's what it's supposed to be. On which side of the large ball is the small ball? Is it to the left or is it to the right? You just write the correct answer there. On which side of the large ball, that's what should have been, uh, is the small ball? Good. You just write your answer there. Okay, this one. Draw the other half of the shape and color it in. For now, you can just um, draw them. Okay, your shape there, you draw it, and then you've got that line of symmetry, your mirror image, and then you draw exactly the same shape on the other side so that you can see the reflection. Remember, same applies to this triangle. You must also draw this line of symmetry or where you fold to show that it is indeed symmetrical it's the same on the other side okay the semicircle same story you draw it and then also you must have that line of symmetry where you fold Okay, if perhaps you would like me to email you uh, this, you can send me your request. You can, you can send me your request and then I can email this to you. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, let's see. I don't think we've got a lot still. 
Mm, Diresh, good, good. Okay, so basically that was our last slide. Okay, if you're able to, to type in your email address. Okay, another thing is that I think it would be easier because of time. Let me go to the slide of my email address so that you can send me the request and then I will email you. Otherwise, if I take all your email addresses, I will miss some of you. Okay. Um, another thing is that I would really want to get feedback in terms of how was it for you to to be doing your 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 class work you know instead of the usual uh, me talking too much eh? right okay um great once it's been wonderful really um having this lesson with you even if we didn't do a lot of talking but we did a lot of writing i hope you enjoyed it as much as i did please um send through reese um, because of time, I think I might miss it. Uh, just send a request to my email address. For sure, I will send it to you. I must say goodbye to all of you. It's been wonderful so that you do not miss your next class. Bye for now. Goodbye. <laughs>